Hi everyone, so today we are going to be doing a Dalmatian video. First you'll be needing a white face paint, a foundation brush, some kind of white eyeliner, it doesn't matter what kind, but any kind of white eyeliner will do. You'll need a black eyeshadow or some black uh, gel eyeliner. A white matte eyeshadow, some kind of chapstick that way you can put on beforehand so that way your lips don't dry out, which is what I'm doing there. First step, you'll be needing to put your hair back so that way it doesn't get in your way of when you're doing your look. Now I'm just taking the white face paint and putting it on the back of my hand so that way it's easier for me to use. So now I'm just grabbing the white face paint and I'm just applying and I'm just going to apply it all over my face. As you can see I'm not putting it directly under directly all the way up to the lash line because otherwise it would crease as I was putting the rest of the face paint all over my face. You don't really have to do anything fancy as you're putting the face paint on, you just really kind of have to get it on your face. Now you can do the uh, glue stick method of flattening your eyebrows and then put the face paint on top of it if you really wanted to. I decided not to just because I felt like since I wasn't going to a party or anything that I didn't need to, but you can if you want. There are plenty of YouTube videos out there that you can watch. Um, I might put one up later that I'll make, but uh, there's plenty of videos out there that you can watch. Now you want to make your face as white as possible, so if you want you can go back in a couple more times than just once. I'm going in a couple more times as you can see later in the video, but also you can drag it onto your neck and put on your ears and your collarbone in that area, but I decide not to just because I'm going to be taking off and I was doing it just for this video, so I thought there was really no point in me wasting a bunch of um I guess just makeup just so that way I can make a video for you today but here I'm just outlining the lips so that way I can put the face paint on my lips at the very very end so that way they don't dry out too much
I'm just taking it down my jaw so that way there isn't such a stark, stark white difference between my face and my jaw area. But you can really use any foundation brush that you like or that you're used to. You can even use a beauty blender if you want to, but I decided not to just because I felt that if the makeup didn't wash out of the brush, I wouldn't be out a $25 beauty blender, whereas this is just a dollar foundation brush from e.l.f. As you can tell, I'm, I'm spending a lot of time just perfecting the white on my face, so that way it's a very stark white because Dalmatians obviously they're white with black spots, so you need to be a pretty good shade of white to achieve that. so that way um, my eyelids get white too. I decided to do that uh, closer to the end so that way it doesn't crease as much. And as you can tell, I'm just outlining the underside of my eyebrow. That way I don't get any of the face paint into my eyebrows. And I'm going to be doing the same thing on the other eye. shadow with my uh, middle finger and just patting that onto my eye area that way nothing creases throughout the day if you were going to be using this as your costume design this year. Go ahead and pat that onto your eyelid and just all in your eye area. And again I'm going to be doing that on the other side too. shadow brush but I just decided not to so that way I didn't get any um again to not get any face paint onto any of my eyeshadow brushes. Now I'm just taking the white eyeliner and I'm going to be putting that in the uh, waterline of my eye just so that way there's a little bit of or not that much of a divide between the white and the flesh color of my um, waterline. Now 
now you don't have to do this step just because I know a lot of people aren't um, comfortable with doing it so just skip that step if you don't if you don't want to do it now I'm just taking off the uh, the chapstick that I put on that way I can put the face paint on my lips and here I am just whiting out my lips with the face paint I'm just stretching on my lips that way all of the white can get into the cracks and the crevices of your lips so that way there isn't like a divide and I was listening to music as I was making this video that's why I'm kind of rocking out Now I'm just going to be making a, I guess, concoction you'd say that I found works um, pretty good for me when I mix it up. It's just um, an eyeshadow and um, contact solution, but you can just use water. It's You can save the money and not have to go out and buy contact solution for this. You can just use water. For this step, you can also use a gel eyeliner, but... I didn't have one on hand, so I just decided to um, use the eyeshadow in the water. So now I'm just outlining um, where I want the spots to be on my face and just filling them in. Now you can use a pencil eyeliner for this too, or a uh, felt tip, I guess, liquid eyeliner, but I just felt that this would be the um, most coverage that I could get with the makeup that I already had without having to go out and buy anything. Now you don't want your spots to be symmetrical in any way just because if you look at a Dalmatian they don't have spots that are exactly the same anymore, anywhere. So you can make um, all kinds of different shapes that you feel. Just go ahead and just do what feels natural to you. Here's where I'm going to be start to draw on the nose. I did around the um, tip of my nose and then um, took it down to between my nostrils so that way it looks like a more of a dog's nose, I guess you'd say. And then I just went and filled it in. Sorry if you can hear any background noise, but there's um, a storm going on as I'm doing the voiceover right now. So sorry for any background noise that you hear. Here I'm just drawing the, um, I guess you call it the little slit, I'm sorry, I don't know the technical name, between the dog's nose and the dog's mouth is, um, because if you look at it, any, like, cartoon character dog or just how people have drawn 
I guess, dog faces on themselves for a long time now. That's just how they've done it. Here I'm just fixing the mouth that I didn't personally like, but you can do whatever kind of mouth shape that you want. There really isn't a structure of how to do a dog's mouth on your own. And when you're doing looks like this, always keep like a rag or some kind of um, cloth that you have laying around the house that you can just wipe um, makeup onto so that way you don't ruin like a good towel of yours or something. doing your Dalmatian you can do as many spots or as yeah you can do as many spots as you want or as you can do not as many if you like you can do one if you want over your eye if that's what you choose for like the traditional Dalmatian look but I just for this look I decided that I didn't want to I wanted to do something a little bit different that's why you see kind of different spots all over my face. suggest for um, doing the spots that you get another kind of face paint. Um, for this look I was using Mayron's face paint which I consider to be pretty good. It's pretty well it's pretty good quality. But um for this kind of look I really wouldn't use any of the grease face paints that you can find at like um Meyer or something just because they don't work very well and just because they slip and slide everywhere and they're just kind of hard to work with really and you don't get that good of a color payoff with them.
I'm just going back in to draw the um dog's mouth that I kind of wanted. I went from one edge of my mouth as I drew the little line down between the um, middle of my lip and I drew like a curved line between and then I did that on the other side also. Now you can do a pink tongue hanging out of the mouth if you wanted to but I just decided not to. I thought it was a little bit of a corny thing that you see like um, first or second graders doing. Which you can do this for your child too but um, I just personally didn't want to for myself. Thank you.